some of the very important question over here and some some tricky question which uh, earlier used to be asked very frequently when information model was uh, you know rising like anything around 2015 16 like that information model used to be very popular and people were focusing more at that point of time right so there can we have some attribute view name in two different package in hana db so this question was one of the popular question at that point of time can we have same attribute view name in two different package in hana db who will tell this answer okay who will tell this answer one of the popular question yes yes awesome harkesh and jayan awesome yes that is possible we have seen right this concept we have seen in our last uh, session that if if it is there in the different packages right it is like the same attribute view name can be there in two different packages because that package is going to be have like a separate unit okay so the answer over here is yes same attribute view name in two different package we can have now another question what is content what is content so write the answer over here in the chat box what is content okay yeah separate delivery unit right correct so the package is used to put you know a package is corresponding to the separate delivery unit that's what jayant is telling so that's right okay what is content what is content who will tell who will give this answer what is content right here in the chat box what is content so the collection of packages so answer over here is the collection of packages is known as content okay collection of packages is known as content okay so uh, then one question can be what is the package right so package is used for purpose of delivery unit means whenever you are going to create a one uh, attribute view or analytical view or calculation view you have to first you will have to create one package right so this package is different than the package which we create in seat okay this uh, package however like if you just try to resonate you will find some similarity right uh, we also use the package in order to uh, in order to put that one into the transport request right here also you require in attribute view a package to put inside a delivery unit okay but uh, there like you know uh, in application server uh, layer suppose if you have a a created one program in a package right so the same program you cannot create even in different package in application server layer right through ac38 that is not possible but here the same attribute view name can be used in different packages okay so that's the difference over here that's the point over here okay so here the collection of packages is known as content another question the system understand the graphical model right so graphical model you know like this is the attribute view which we have created over here right so does the system understand this one no system does not understand this this figure and all system does not understand you know that the system understand the computer understand only machine language the language of zero and one right so ultimately all these things is going to be converted into zero and one but before that actually before that you know when you activate the information model it gets converted into the column view this is the technical object okay this is the technical object okay so that technical object ultimately gets you know converted into whatever the machine language at all is there but that's the basic technical object that technical object is known as the column view when you when you activate your attribute view okay so 
third point here you can see when we create any information model it creates a corresponding column view because system does not know the graphical representation it has to be converted into technical object so that system could understand name of the column view is going to be like a schema name dot package name slash information model name so here you'll have to give answer no answer no then what it understands it's understand it understands column view and the name of the column view is suppose your information model uh, your attribute view in name let's suppose your attribute view is at demo one right then column view is going to be what a schema name let's suppose your schema name is sap dv2 this is the schema name dot the package name package name let's suppose demo package then slash the information model name at underscore demo so this is going to be the name of the column view okay and this will be like in a double quotes over here schema name here put into double quotes then demo package so like that it's going to be the name of the column view this is the technical object this is actually understood by the system okay so whenever you put any select query on the attribute view system puts the select query on this column view actually right so the corresponding it, it puts the select query on the corresponding column view and this is responsible for you know fetching the data okay fine another question when we activate the information model which object is generated so answer is the column view right answer is the column view here just write it over here the answer is column view 